Effect of sodium phosphate supplementation on cycling time trial performance and VO2. 1 and 8 days post-loading. About the study. The study was to test sodium phosphate for its capabilities as an ergogenic aid during 6 days of SP supplementation on short duration. The study proposed SP will have an increase in the number of possible mechanisms regarding endurance performance. The mechanisms are the increased diphosphoglycerate that greatly facilitate release of oxygen from hemoglobin to the muscle, increased extracellular and intracellular phosphate availability, which will increase the rate of ATP production and enhance cellular metabolism during exercise, increased intramuscular contractions of ATP, PCR, and inorganic phosphate for more rapid restoration, restoration of these molecules during aerobic and anaerobic exercise, increased cardiac muscle contractility, and increased buffering capacity of hydrogen ions. To date, only a few studies investigated the effect of SV actual exercise performance. The previous studies were only on prolonged exercise, which is more than 20 minutes, and there are currently no studies on SV exercise the purpose for this study was to investigate the effects of six days of SP supplementation on short duration cycling time trial performance, both one and eight days post loading, approximately three to four minutes and 10 to 12 minutes. The methods consisted of 21 male cyclists who volunteered for this experiment, although there were two cyclists who failed to complete the study. The experimental design consisted of two time trials. One was a 3-4 to four minute cycling time trial, and the second one was a 10-12 to 12 minute cycling time trial. The cyclists were divided into two groups. One group drank the sodium phosphate, while the other group drank the placebo. Both groups drank their respected supplements after the first day of time trials, then continued drinking until day 8 when the second time trial was assessed. The supplement the results showed that trials did not display any significant differences as well as no medium to large effect sizes. For the 8-day serum phosphate test, first minute VO2 tended to be higher than the placebo. The SP group finished slightly faster at 313 seconds and produced 2% greater average power. Heart rate perceived exertion, blood lactate post-exercise post were similar between groups. In conclusion, no significant differences were found in heart rate, ratings of perceived exertion, and blood lactate post-exercise within or between any trials, while serum phosphate values were not different before or after supplementation with SP or PL. This study showed a tendency for increased VO2 in a shorter duration, approximately 3-4 to four minutes, with cyclists on day 8 after SP supplementation, but no difference in 100 or 250 kilograms.